industry that is the backbone of the entire economy. Sometimes I get criticized because I say in public I want to try to get as many trucks off the road as possible, uh, but I don't mean that in a derogatory sense. I mean that to uh, trying to save you fuel, and when it gets to four or five bucks, you'll uh, you'll be uh, supporting some of the proposals of, uh, uh, that I that I uh, would champion that uh, trying to get more on rail and drive on whatever we can do. Trying to get you to maximize that great uh, service that you provide and hopefully make an even better profit. So, uh, uh, looking at solutions. So, we welcome your suggestions. We'll look at the hour thing as we go along. And then, Mr. Fromm, um, uh, Mr. Fromm is, uh, is a businessman invested uh, in uh, what the assets of Colorado Rail are and uh, his predecessor. Was an incredible entrepreneur and developed a diesel motorized unit. Those are self propelled rail cars. It is only expense, no federal development money. Then he went further than anyone in the United States in getting the vehicle crash tech tested at his own expense. Put it all together. He's doing fairly well, and they actually acquired some for Florida but with the running uh, the tri rail system. We're on our way to Portland and tomorrow, uh, on seeing those, we'll look at those. On the 4th of uh, March, and I highly recommend to the, those folks in Ohio come down to Miami, as uh, we're going to have a display um, of uh, his vehicles that are, have been running for years and with great fuel efficiency, uh, very low emissions, uh, cost competitive to other things, to the, uh, the, uh, other options. But um, unfortunately, Mr. Brader got involved in some other investments and, and then got hit by the economy and uh, went bankrupt, I believe it was. And uh, Mr. Obama made a very wise investment in securing uh, all of that uh, uh, technology and the ability to produce those vehicles. Uh, I am sold on them. Um, I think that. Uh, the, the, the problem he's had is he's had to deal with the federal bureaucracy to put a self-propelled uh, passenger vehicle on some existing or semi-abandoned uh, uh, routes that run through the hearts of city and they can provide a, 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 just an essential service at the lowest possible cost. And uh, God help us that the, uh, the process is just so cumbersome amazing that um, anything can be done, but we're going to see if we can get something done to get that kind of technology that has been developed in the United States back here, and he's looking at, again, manufacturing and activities located here in uh, this area, so we're pleased to see you in the back of the I have spoken to people on uh, 